Hi, my name is David Ragg. I'm a UK-based florist, although I've travelled the world teaching and demonstrating and meeting other amazing, cool florists all over the world, where I draw all my inspiration from. I think we should never stop learning from each other, and one thing's for sure, we should always have fun with what we do. The design I want to make is a standing design. I'm going to start with this base here. This is actually just a piece of timber that's been covered in the bark. It's been stapled on and very carefully, of course, we just drill into the base here. And this will fit nice and tight inside if you've got the right drill bit. If you need to glue it, you can glue that into place. And then this will mount straight into there and stand nice and firm in there as well. So it all ties in, matches. As you can see, I've started a little way down and we're just gonna wind this on. You go all the way to the end and back up again. And you may also notice that on these, I've got a little, a little bump of the bind wire here and that's just to replicate the sort of natural features that you get on a, a branch or a stick. So when you've got back to the start point, you can just add on one of these little wood slices. And then I'm just gonna continue up the, up the stem here uh, with the bind wire. And then also on here, I'm gonna add a tube. Let's take a little bit of the bind wire, twist it on. And then this can be secured. And that'll keep that nice and steady on there, which I'm gonna place into the drilled holes around like this. Now this is quite a hard wire to use. You might need some pliers or at least some very strong fingers. A bit like a vine in a jungle, kind of weaving its way through the trees. just to secure that. So we're just gonna take a look at our structure and we've got tubes uh, in many places so we can be quite generous with the flowers but I don't wanna overdo it and I also wanna get plenty of height in here I'm just going to start off though by getting some of the little gerbera here. Removing a lot of the lower leaves and taking the stem relatively short so that it stands nice and steady in the, in the tube. I'm going to add some of the, the grasses. Again, you can come up nice and tall you get uh, you know real real presence here with these shapes. Uh, these little flowers will work really well because the the redness of them will just pick up the centre of those gerbera. And again, just pop them in low down. You need to take time just to stand back and uh, have a look at your design, maybe from a slight distance, see how the colour distribution's working, if you've got any real obvious areas that could just do with a little injection of colour or form. Have a go, get your drill out, get your winding fingers working and have some fun. <laughs>